I think that Romeo and Juliet is the lamest of all of Shakespeare's plays. You're being so negative about the show. Why? How? Why would our audience even think it? I'm really enjoying this version of the show because I'm working with a lot of people that I like. Um, namely, the woman playing Montague's wife uh, and the lady playing my wife. She is, of course, the loveliest lady in the land. So said the mirror. What is your favorite part about this show? Don't call me mommy. That's really creepy. <laughs> really creepy. Mommy. I love calling you mommy. <laughs> What's your, why, why did you audition for the show? Because I wanted to be in the show. It's my last show before I leave college. It's my last show before I Talk to the camera. <laughs> but I love looking at your face. Aww. This is my best friend. <laughs> Okay, okay like sisters, but whatever. You you ace your interview. Good job, good job. Okay, thanks. This is the golden years. I'm the end of that name of also. You say well, Sonny. Dude. Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. Oh, perfect. I'd have to say the blood. Do what? Blood scenes. The blood scenes? Yes. Are you even involved in the blood scenes? No, but I think they're amazing. Did you, did you make any really good friends during the show, or did you know everyone when you came in? Uh, I made a lot of friends. You made a lot of friends? Yeah. <laughs> like, like Avery right there. I made friends with her. Look out. Okay. It's star in the show right here. You know I'm the star of the show? I know it's called Romeo and Juliet, but it really should just be called The Friar Show. You guys are really fun, and I like your plays that you do, and I've had a really great time this summer, and I've met a lot of new people, including Zach, I suppose. <laughs> and, and one more question, more character-based this time. What do you do every day to get in the mode of Mouse? What I sing Three Blind Mice to okay. get in the character of Mouse, and then and I put glue on my face. <laughs> he was messing with one of my eight cheerleader girlfriends that I'm juggling at the moment right now. They, they don't know. Burr, well, took our fit. What's the what's? Yeah. If you be me, sir, I desire some confidence with you. She would like to some supper. Favorite part, my dramatic death. That when I jump off the stage and just punch Ethan right in, right in the face. Yeah. Yes. So, Very good. So, how long have you been doing shows? Um, I'd say, I don't know, about eight or, eight or nine years. So, you must like it? Yes. Do they pay you a lot? Uh, they pay me in knowledge, I guess. <laughs> they pay me in knowledge. What you like to say to your directors? Uh, Grandma, you know I love you, and be thankful I'm doing this play because this is exhausting me. Tammy, you know I love you too. You're like my third mom. Second, second, third, I got a lot of moms. But yes. It's not awkward. We're going to surrender up. Come, sir. Start off. Well, when I'm on stage, of course. Oh, Obviously. well, yes. I'm an actor, and all actors really just love themselves. That's why we do. So, We're all arrogant. So you're thrilled about your really long, long lines that are like nine paragraphs sewn together. Yeah, and the giant run-on sentences. Yeah. Are great. So you nail them quite, quite well. Just saying. I'm gonna go this way now. To my directors, thanks a lot for letting me be in the show, even though I'm an old guy and I'm a creeper. But it's a lot of fun. Oh, you're not a creeper. I know I'm not. But it's a lot of fun. I enjoy it a lot. You guys really did something cool here. I mean, it's really enjoy Juliet Shakespeare. It's awesome. Completely revamped. Completely revamped. Completely revamped. revamped. And you were a part Newer, of it. Newer, better, You're one of the first. stronger than ever before. Yeah, go kill him. Oh, yeah.
My work play, my chance been to have her matched. And having now provided a gentleman of noble parentage, youthful and nobly lined, proportioned as one's thought would wish a man.